Hey, hope you're doing well today. Look, uh, today's the day after Thanksgiving. Now, you may be sitting here thinking, oh, I don't feel good about the choices I made on Thanksgiving. I don't feel good about the amount of turkey I ate, amount of mashed potatoes I ate. I don't feel good about the amount of grandma's cream pie I ate or Aunt Lucy's pumpkin pie. You know, it, it may be something for you. I'm going to be honest with you. I've been doing pretty good on my on my health journey, um, tracking my calories, doing my exercise. But yesterday, I didn't do any exercise. Uh, we was with the family all day. We did church activities all day, and I had normal size lunch. But I'm gonna I'm tell you something. I did something yesterday. I'm not proud of, in any way, shape, or form. I ate some pecan pie, and pecan pie is one of my favorite things. But I went to the store to look for a personal size pecan pie. But guess what? They didn't have any. All they had was a pecan pie, and nobody in my house eats pecan pie. And I didn't want to have to deal with this pecan pie all week, so I didn't eat breakfast. I didn't eat dinner. Ate a normal size lunch, but yesterday, I confess to you, and you can say what you want, put it out there, t t tell me how horrible I am. I ate a pecan pie. I didn't eat a slice of pecan pie. I ate a pecan pie. Now, I still feel horrible about this morning. Like mentally, I feel bad. Emotionally, I feel mad because I know what they did to me calorie wise. But here's the deal. I'm gonna get over it. I'm not gonna have two bad days in a row. Today, I'm gonna get back on it. I'm gonna get back on my health journey. I'm gonna get back on my, I pre-made my meals, right? Uh, be at the gym later today. But here's the deal, you may feel this way in your spiritual life. Like you may have had a day yesterday or, or one day last week, or you may have a day coming up where you just completely blow your spiritual plan, your walk with Jesus. But here's the beautiful thing, Paul reminds us in Romans 8, 37. He says, look, we are more than conquerors and he lists all these things so trials or tribulations or death or defeat shall shall it keep us down no so i want to remind you no matter how bad you think you did no matter how bad yesterday was let's try not to have two bad days in a row and no matter how bad you did you you may have had a spiritual pecan pie incident right so you are completely ashamed of and you probably would not do what i'm doing and telling other people about it i get it but I want to remind you, beloved, listen to this. You are beloved by God. No matter how bad yesterday was, no matter how bad one day is, you are still a child of God in the hand of Jesus. And because of Jesus' death, burial, and resurrection, you are more than a conqueror. So get back up, push forward, do what you know you got to be doing, and trust and rest in the grace of Jesus. God bless. Hope you have a good day.